Hello, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to increase your print speed on SCARA Elite printers uh, for some specialized cases. Depending on your object shape as well as what your nozzle size settings are uh, on the actual hose and in your slicer could reduce speed if you have uh, some certain objects of certain designs. So we're going to show you how to increase your print speed. So uh, here we have a, our SCARA profile loaded in Kira with some basic settings for printing with concrete with our SCARA Elite such as the layer height being set to 10 and the line width set to 19 millimeters which is about one inch. So uh, here on the print speeds you obviously have the print speed control we're going to change all these to 100 So we have a print speed of 100, so this is beneficial if you're working with the printer interface. So when you are using the percent speed slider, if you increase it to 150, you're now printing at 150 millimeters per second. So it's useful to set your print speed to 100 here. Uh, we are now going to go into the printer settings. So we have uh, 3D Potter Scara, and we're going to click Manage Printer. and here in Kira, it's under machine settings. So uh, under machine settings, there is extruder one. So to fix these issues for the SCARA Elite, which uses a uh, cement pump separated from the printer, we're going to change this compatible material diameter to 51 millimeters. And that will greatly improve the performance of the SCARA depending on your, like I said earlier in this video, of your object shape or nozzle size settings might be interfering with the speed of the machine. So we're going to go ahead and hit close on this and save these settings. And then the second thing to do is actually going to be editing the config file of your printer. And so this can be done under the printer interface and going to uh, system and then config.g and I'm going to show you what it looks like here on notepad. You can also edit it on notepad from the SD card. And here on the M203 line, we're going to be changing these values here to 15,000 on X and Y. And on Z, we're just going to actually just add two zeros on the end. Uh, this cannot be done for our normal extruder system. This would, on this E value, that would greatly overspeed the extruder. So if you are using an extruder system, make sure you go ahead and take these two zeros off, back off, if you are going to be using our clay extruder. And you should only be doing this if you're actually using our pump system with our SCARA Elite. And this is just a way, depending, like I said, just to increase your maximum speeds if you are having issues with particular object shapes or nozzle sizes with our SCARA Elite printing with concrete. Thank you.